Hello darlings and welcome to the last day of Fashion Ho Week! I can't believe we've made it so far, it's been an incredible week for me actually because you know shopping, then making hauls, it's a dream come true. <laughs> Another dream would be to keep everything that I purchased but oh well you can have everything. So first let's begin with the drill, please subscribe if you haven't already, turn on your notifications to be notified next week when I show you what I have actually kept from the whole whole week. You can also subscribe to my Instagram, I will link it over there. I make a lot of reels because I'm having fun with that, I post occasionally, so you can just follow me over there to see what I do on an everyday basis. So today's haul is going to be... Dun -dun -dun! H&M! H&M has become one of my favorite brands for the past couple of months because they have upgraded so so much their materials, their collaborations, their everything and now I just cannot wait to shop from them because I find such good things in there for not a lot of money and that's what we want, isn't it? And without further ado, let's begin with our last haul I think there are quite a lot of good finds in this haul and let me begin with something that has been restocked from last year and it's that beautiful, very very beautiful linen blend floral dress. I mean it's amazing, it looks incredible, I have seen it over everybody last summer and it was out of stock for the longest of time and they have started restocking some of their previous year stuff. and. That dress is one of them. I mean the flowers look like they're painted with watercolors, they are so cute, so feminine. It does have a smoked bead at the back as well, which makes it very very comfortable. It's lined on the inside and it does have buttons that go from top to all the way down, but I don't think you're actually gonna see them that much once you wear it. And all in all, I just think it's a very, very beautiful dress. You might want to wear it for spring with a cardigan or during summer on its own with a very, very beautiful bag and you're gonna look fabulous, but also you're staying comfortable because, you know, comfort is key. So I think that this dress is everything. I love the pattern. I got the smallest size, so I think it was UK6. I love the bodies, how it cinches in over here and then it gives you that beautiful hourglass silhouette, the length to it as well. I think it's very easy to wear, I think it's the perfect, perfect spring-summer dress. I am obsessed. The colors, the figure, everything. It's amazing. They have this dress in other patterns as well actually, so I will make sure that I link all of them down below just because that's, that's amazing. I love how it fits and everything. Let's start with some of my spring summer essentials and I cannot go in the sun without a straw hat. So two years ago I bought a straw hat and I haven't taken it off, I still use it to this day and I think I can upgrade with a nicer one from H&M. I just think it's very cute because of that thing over here and it's like a brown color but they also have it in white, I just decided to go with brown because everything I have is like beige brown. It looks like I have, like, my sheep are coming. I think my grandma will love me with this. <laughs> I think it's the actual cutest thing ever and if you do use it in Scotland or somewhere in the UK, you know how windy it might get sometimes. And this one can actually keep it safe, it's not only for being cute and everything. So I think it's a very... it's a very interesting hat. I had to try this dress on with this hat. 
Oh, I think that they are adorable together. I don't know if I will actually keep this head, but I think it's the cutest thing ever. And if you can actually pull it off, then, then I want to see photos because it's going to look amazing. I might be on a journey of obsession with straw heads because I have another one for you. And this one is actually, I think I prefer it. It's very cute. Look at that. And I think it's going to look beautiful with that dress. It's like plain dress up, but with hats. It's amazing. I don't know if it's going to be that comfortable. It's a, it actually is. It is very comfortable. And it's gonna shade you from the sun a lot because it has like a larger brim over here. And it does sit very comfortably on the head. I have a small head. So most of the heads that I try on, they like fly away or like moving a lot. And this one fits perfectly actually and it's very very cute so yeah i got another straw head and let me know in the comments which one should i keep this one or the previous one i wanted to try this head as well with this dress because i think that dress is the perfect match to a straw head and that's adorable so i think i actually prefer this head just because it, i i love how it goes down over here and it's going to keep you safe from the sun but also look very chic while doing so the next thing that i ordered is yet another top yes there's not going to be a haul without a beautiful top and this one is again very simple but it has very beautiful details to it like the thicker straps which i think is going to be very complimenting to my body and shape and everything and also i love the square neckline that's what drew me to that top exactly to be honest they have it in other colors i think it was black and lilac if i'm not wrong or blue but i decided to go with the white because it's just a universal color it goes with everything and it's a very cute for spring summer so this top is very cute as well it's very figure hugging and just as expected it's basic but kind of unique as well i've just paired it with the asos shorts that i tried on day two of fashion Ho week i'll link them over here i love the back side do it too and it's just a very basic top that's going to go with everything let's love each other Thing. I am a bit disappointed and it's shorts they're something again very basic they're called the vintage shorts and I decided to get a size 10 out of them but I guess vintage means that they're going with the vintage sizing as well because there's no way that's going to fit my ass but oh well we cannot go without a failure I guess and it still might fit me it just doesn't seem like it would but all in all, it's a pretty color, it's a staple piece for your wardrobe. The back is very simple, pockets, I love that bit over here that says denim on it. And yeah. And now let's talk about the shorts. So I did squeeze into them, but they are too tight and too short for my liking. I am definitely going to be returning them, but I'll still link them in case they're your kind of vibe. They're just not what I like. I like to be a little bit more covered over here which I hoped would be with these ones I do like that they're actually quite high-waisted which gives it a nice figure at the top they just don't feel like my thing I'm not going to feel comfortable going outside in them but if you do like them by all means go for it I am not exactly sure what I was thinking I just wanted to go with the stripes and have something very comfortable that's actually going to be perfect for summer I don't think it's that much of a spring item it's more of a summer something that you can wear on the beach like throw it very quickly on with your bikini underneath so this one is 100% viscose I would have much preferred a cotton or a cotton blend but I will still try it on and give it a chance as you know like once you try something on it looks different than when you're showing it just like that the details to it are very cute it has like frills at the top 
and it also has that big frill over here and now this little dress I kind of have a love-hate relationship with it I kind of like it but I kind of don't <laughs> Like I really think that I would probably wear it if I was going to the beach but also there's probably way better things over there to go to the beach with. It's like very open and very free so you can easily walk in it, you can easily put it on and off which is a must when you're like on the beach and you're wearing bikini and everything like that so if it is kind of your vibe then cool but I don't know if it's mine oh I know I kind of like it the material is not my favorite but it does feel very light like the material is okay <laughs> let's say I think I have saved the best for last and no it's not another straw head it's a pair of shoes oh, the cutest shoes that I have ever seen like look at that bow honestly these are dream shoes they do have a very small heel which means that they are very comfortable I actually already tried them on because I screamed when I opened it first and look how beautiful they are those bows and the small tiny heel I think you can just live in this they are the most amazing color as well it's again lilac but they also have them in beige for somebody that likes something more neutral and not so colorful but I think these ones are gonna go very well with neutral tones as well and how amazing are they I am in love that's the end of today's haul and the end of fashion haul week for spring summer 2021 let me know down in the comments which things you think i should definitely keep and let me know if you like this kind of haul weeks if you would like to see something like that in the future maybe i actually fell in love with it when freddie my love was doing it on her channels and all do i love her style mine is pretty much different and i don't think there's enough of fashion haul weeks so that's why I decided to do it and yeah, Freddy was my inspiration. So darlings, thank you again for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you again in my next one to see what I have kept. Love you all to the moon and back. Bye!